Yeah, there's a there's there's a, another thing I'd like I'd like to say. There's no there's no mention in in this article, uh, page three, express an echo, of the concerns of local traders, local businesses, which I think, at least I ca- no, I can't see. I really can't see it here, and I think that is part of the story. Um, the 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 consultation doesn't seem to have been that good, really. Um, there's 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 at least one head. Well, there's a uh, there's a hairdresser I know who wasn't on the the map originally, the Devon County Council map. I had to tell them about their existence. Um, the the print shop and Robinson's News are distributing leaflets, and they make several several points in that. And. Um, I I I th- I think it would be good if Ben Bradshaw or some somebody um, from the extra Labour Party spent half a day based at Robinson's News, for example, look, looking at South Lawn Terrace, looking at North Street, and making a judgment as to how busy it was, and t- talk to a few people, ask them what they what they think about it. But also maybe explore the idea of a 15-minute city. But, um, and it sort of came to my mind because of this uh, this mention of um, far-right conspiracy groups. Because the 15-minute city has become known almost entirely through negative um, coverage, I would say. It's one. It's one of the terrible things we're going to be rescued from, like like twenty mile an hour zones. Uh, I'm just sorry. I, in in the play, the, the all the, all these points of view will be balanced out by other people saying it differently. But I'm just sort of shorthanding at the moment. Um, but actually, a lot of the ideas in the fifteen minute city are are quite interesting, and I think. If Exeter City Council and Devon County Council really took a look at it, it would it would at least have the benefit that it's an idea which has a, a, a transport aspect and also um, a general purpose planning pro- um, aspect. Because at the moment, Devon County Council's scope is just traffic, and Exeter City Council, you would think, um, cover everything else. Um, but I, ca- I, I I've been told it, that 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 shops like like a newsagent or a post office or a, a hairdresser going out of business would only be a planning issue if there was a change of use. So at the point that became a house, the planning department would be interested. But whether the traffic arrangements lend themselves to business continuing or any sort of resource being available locally um that's uh it's, it's hard to see who would be interested in that question but the 15 minute city might might raise it and I, I also on on twitter i'm i'm getting more communication with um various people but they they include um Mag- magdalen road uh greengrocer operations I'm not going into too much because I, 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 I don't. I, I generally don't favour repeating everything from Twitter on the on the radio. But um, you could think of um, Magdalen Road as one 15-minute city, and um, somewhere, let's say, Hevetry, Hevetry Pleasure Ground as another centre of a city, which obviously would be a god a garden city of some some sort. Uh, Anyway, I think I'll go back to Aswad. 